hope I don't accidentally share any launch codes or anything. <laughs> <laughs> and see, last time All right, I, I think I got comfy and I had no clue that it was even like live. <laughs> oh, really? No, anyway, I think we're live. Hi, world. Hello, everybody. Yeah, I think it's working now. Hello, world. What the heck? <laughs> so I got the notification that it's live, but I go to your YouTube page and I don't see it live. Oh, there oh, we go. Oh, it's live. I see it right now. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's my ugly mug up there for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> Cover boy. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It's, all right. Let's Muted. Try. We got Bizmodo. About time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I told them. I told them there's little technical difficulties. Yeah. You can blame me. <laughs> blame it on me. I was over here trying to troubleshoot it for like what hour, something like that. Right. Insane. So. All right. Pop out chat. There we go. Minimize that. All right. What's up, Mohawk Mike? Classic J, what is going on, bud? We're just going to have a little fun hangout session and play some games. And again, this is all trial and error. <laughs> we're 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 figuring we're figuring this out as we go. Punishers from California. Hey Punishers. Let's try this setting. Boom. Now all three of us are on at the same time. We're not just staring at your beard, Ray Ray. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, oh, to get lost. Easy to get lost in that beard. It, mm, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. If, you, if you've seen Sir Flesh Wounds. It's like oh, I have. Beard. He looks like Gandalf. <laughs> he, yeah, it is. <laughs> hey, Amanda. What's going on? Oh, good so, stuff. So for everyone that's joining, we're going to try to play Jackbox games. So there's going to be some intermittent pausing going on while we get the games loaded. And then we'll, you guys will basically be watching us play along. So I may not be on the screen, but you'll see uh, these two, like looking on the screen to see how it's actually being broadcast. But you'll see uh, Ray and that one guy, you'll see them playing and... We're just going to have some fun with it, see how this works out. Hopefully it <laughs> works. That would be awkward if it didn't. Yeah, Amanda, it was funny. Yesterday, I seen Moto Carrie's post on her story that you were live, and I just was feeding the baby, and I'm like, oh, no. So then I go over there, and it had like just finished, so I was a little bummed out. <laughs> I was trying to watch her live stream and grocery shop at the same time, multitasking for the win. Yes, absolutely. Going on. <laughs> yep. And it was it was actually hopping. Uh, there was like a hundred people in the chat at one point. It was kind of it's actually kind of difficult to keep up. Wow, yeah. that's awesome. That's awesome. Parties at Amanda's <laughs> house. Great. Okay. So here goes the game. God, I hope I do this right. So now you're going to send us a link, right? In our uh, group chat for the I'll game? I'll send it to the chat. OK. All right. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Hanging on. Okay, I'm gonna open that in Safari, and then oh, what's for dinner? Amanda. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> I 
had like half my dinner. <laughs> I got some nice. basil guys to snack on. Nice. I, went, I actually went grocery shopping tonight, so I had no time for dinner. <laughs> All right. All right. Hopefully Carrie, this... is the is the code going to be in our chat in yes. Instagram? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. What's up, Land Shark? Land Shark. Orale. <laughs> I was wondering when someone was going to mention your backdrop. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa, what happened? Hang on. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, what did I what expected. did I touch? That was expected. <laughs> Nothing broke. Okay. <laughs> Holy cow. It yeah, it's per it's a it's actually pretty loud. Okay. Unless I just have my speakers up. All right, that's better. Have your speakers up. I'm going to hit this and basically you'll know if it's going to be too loud or not. Okay. Still pretty loud. <clears throat> Still pretty loud. It's harder to hear you. Yeah. How about now? Maybe a little lower. Give it a test run and we'll see. What yeah. Maybe we'll change our minds. Okay. So these are the games. You can do You Don't Know Jack, which I think most people will know this for. I'm going to be the game song so I can talk. Um, so there's You Don't Know Jack. There is Fibbage. Uh, have, you, have either of you played these games before? Yes. Man, no. <laughs> no? Fibbage is fun. I think Why you don't know Jack, isn't that just like a, a trivia game? I realized if I muted my computer, I can't hear you guys. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I've played I've played these games before. I think Jack is just a trivia game, and then um, Fibbage is it's fun. Uh, drawful. It depends on how well you draw, but it can also be hilarious if you can't draw well. <laughs> So yeah, then they're all they're all easy. They're all easy to pick okay. up too. All right. Let's do Fibbage. We'll start with Fibbage. Oops, wrong way. So hang tight for a sec. Okay, Carrie. I I'm just gonna say it. You look very Pam esque, especially when you had the office backdrop. <laughs> it's the glasses. <laughs> it, I think it's it's got to be the glasses. Pam's awesome, though. Yeah, she is awesome. She is cool. And we're just finally to the point now where they're, uh, her and Jim are, I guess, finally able to date. Okay. <laughs> oh, you guys, you got pretty far. Yeah. yeah we're season three, I think, right now. Let's see. All right, I am in. All right. All right. Eric, let me know when you're in. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. Give it a second. Okay. Everybody's in. And then I think you can, sh I mean, if you want, you can let people in on the. On the, uh, Hello, code I'm your host, Cookie Master oh, yeah, right And before we get yeah. started, I just want to say, you're welcome. Okay, there are three of you playing this game, but you 
probably know that because you can count. Let's do this. <laughs> this is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. Boy. Evergreen Cemetery includes an odd statue of Jesus wearing blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking it's true. If you get stuck for half the points, you can use the help button and get a suggestion. Do it now. Okay, here are your choices. Find the truth and touch it on your device. All right, let's see what everybody picked. Thanks, Ray. Evergreen Cemetery is, of course, in Texas. <laughs> and the rest of the board goes unselected. Anybody from Texas there in the chat? Yeah. <laughs> uh, time to pick a category. Ooh, okay. Okay, here's the question. New Mexico State Senator Duncan Scott successfully got a bill passed in the New Mexico Senate requiring psychiatrists testifying in court to wear a blank. Type in your lies now. If you get a spelling error, it makes it really obvious that you're using the right answer. <laughs> Hurry up, use a suggestion if you can't think of Okay. Okay, here are your choices. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, nice check. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who picked what? Thank you, guys. Oh, nice. Thank you. <laughs> nice. And look what we have oh, here. God. <gasps> what? The bill did not make what? it past the New Mexico House, however. They declared that a courtroom is no place for funny outfits unless you're the judge. And that means this lie didn't get picked. Do it. Where the, All right, uh, pick a category. The sorting hat. Right. <laughs> okay, here's the question. It's time for a celebrity tweet. 4.32 p.m., the 22nd of May, 2012. At Lindsay Lohan tweeted, Blank is the best medicine. Enter your lies now. Oh, 2012 Lindsay Lohan. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> okay, what did everyone pick? Oh man, it's gonna be working, isn't it? Good for you, Lindsay. <laughs> Which explains why she's been so ill. Oh man. And nobody fell for this one. <laughs> Snow cane. Oh yeah. Snow cane. <laughs> <laughs> 
Now it's round two, where all point values are doubled. Let's do it. Select a category. Oh, oh boy. Okay, here's the question. Steroids. After an allergic reaction to steroids used to treat asthma, a 28-year-old woman started growing blank on her head instead of hair. Type in your lies now. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, which one's the truth? Wow, okay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. <laughs> Tried to enter that now one. When she wants to look nice, she goes out and gets a many heady. Oh, really? <laughs> and that means some of these didn't get picked. Oh. <laughs> the close one. Oh. Time to pick a category. All right. Okay, here's the question. Pantherophobia is the constant fear of your blank. Enter your lies now. I don't know. Something's happening. All right. Where's the truth? What? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's take a look. <laughs> okay, okay. And that's it. Nobody else's oh. lies got picked. Oh, that was a big round for you, Carrie. What's that? That was a big round for you. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Blair Tolman wrote a self-help book called Blank for Under a Dollar, 301 Ideas. Type in your lies now. Hmm. Okay, here are your choices. Friggin' harvest. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> Disclaimer. All of them will be first dates. And nobody picked the other lies up there. It's time Ooh, for the final oh fibbage. Just one final question, and it's worth triple. Good luck. Okay, Ugh. here is your final fibbage question. The Michelin Man's strange official name. Enter your lies now.
Hurry, hit the lie for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, which Nine. one's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. Should I stick on the next one? Oh, everything went low. Well, don't you feel foolish? But now it's hard to see him as anything but a bibendum. And look at what we have left. One single, lonely, pitiful lie. Yeah. Okay. Be right back. Okay. Eric, you still with us? Yeah, it's just really uh, laggy. Okay. Oh. Yeah, and I, yeah. Did it kick you off of the the game thing on your phone? Yeah, it kicked me off yeah. of the game. Okay. Yeah, yeah I should have done it just now for that. But yeah, you have to do it again. Let's do draw. draw. Honey, why are you crying? What is the matter? Slight pause while we get into oh, God. the game. See, so I don't know if it still shows us like chatting or not. I never got to experiment with that before. Oh, the side chat and all that? Yeah, or like the video and the rest of it. Like, I don't know if it still oh, shows us okay. like, talking. I think it does. Right. Yeah. Oh, boy. Eric, is it letting you in? Oh. Yes. Oh, there this we go. Terrible. Okay. <laughs> All right. And Everybody in? Everybody is in. I'm in. I got it. Okay, cool. Okay. One. All right. It's drawful time. Wow. Three player game. I like it. Everybody will get three shots at drawing something not terrible. Let's play. Okay, I'm sending a title to each of your devices. Something unusual, like Spain or Drunk Uncle. Draw a picture on your device that would have that title, and when you're done, hit send, and you'll get points for each player that can correctly guess your title. So, get to drawing. This is bad. I don't know how anybody's gonna get this. Can you erase? I don't know, oh, man. No. Nope. Okay. 
This is gonna be super random. Okay, let's get to the good part. Um. Now, use your device to type in what you think the title for this picture could have been. Or better yet, something you think could trick the other players into thinking it's the title. You'll get points for every player that picks your answer. Choices. Now pick the title you think really inspired this drawing. Ah! Hey! And here are your picks. <laughs> huh, I didn't expect everybody to get that one right. <laughs> Uh. Oh, and now this. Type in a convincing <laughs> title now. Oh, I don't even know. What? <laughs> don't ask. What? <laughs> 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 Are your choices. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> what did everybody pick? We could have made it more specific, like the Real Housewives of Orange County or something, but why make it that hard? Yeah, that was supposed to be a glass of wine. <laughs> Mighty big glass of wine. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I that's why I was like, and you were racist. <laughs> that's a mama's oh. size glass. Type in your titles now. And here are your choices. Oh, what? <laughs> we all were. <laughs> hey! 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 <laughs> Here's everybody's picks. <laughs> oh, nice decoy. Are we done with this one? I think we're done with this one. Yeah, we're done. <laughs> Ray is taking it away. Another batch of titles are heading All to your right. devices as I speak. Get ready to draw them. Oh, God. Oh, boy.
Okay, all your pictures are in. Let's take a look. Home. Enter anything that could almost make sense now. Okay, here are your choices. Jurassic Park. All right, who picked what? Ah! That's a good one. Nice. <laughs> I don't know what to say about that one, nice. so I won't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> I like Jurassic Park. <laughs> I was trying to remember the skater guy's name, and it was totally drawing a blank in the moment. That was the first, I just don't ask, I'm broken upstairs. That was the first thing that came to mind. Oh. Enter your titles now! Oh, boy. And here are your choices. Here's everybody's picks. Oh my God. <laughs> you all random. thought one of our oh. random decoys was the right answer. I love oh. it when that happens. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, Seriously? Yeah, yeah, I got the two yeah, weirdest. I worry that you're all going to start really overthinking arrows in this game now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, man. Dominating. Oh. Yes, I think they had some yeah, Put in your titles now. <laughs> yeah, I'm so sorry, you guys. My phone glitched. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it took my drawing in this ah! right Oh. Oh. I got a good one. And the answer is going to be so far. Here are your choices. Oh. Ah! Hey! What did everybody pick? We should make t-shirts out of some of these. Two lines I cut out before the phone. Yeah. Moment. <laughs> nice. You got halfway there. <laughs> nice. Nice. Dang. Good Let's job. do this drawing thing one last time. All right. Oh, God. Oh, 
great. All the okay, pictures I gotta apologize in advance for mine. Oh. Enter anything that could almost make sense now. <laughs> Not well thought out at all. Good decoy one for this. And here are your choices. Thing. choices. I have nothing That's to say about that. Guys, I'm like, did you the same weird prompt I did? Because it's like, you literally do nothing right now. Like... Hey! Ah! Here comes the ah! job. Good job. Ah! Oh, wait, I didn't see the one. Ah! Uh -huh. And I like, Second oh, I didn't game, see who ready won. to go. I've already sent your new titles to your devices. Oh my god. Oh god.
Ah! I have all your pictures now. Um, these are interesting. Uh, let's take a look. Now let's take a look at this one. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Here are your choices. <laughs> no freaking way. No way. Oh. Ah! Hey! Has to be, right? I mean... What did everybody pick? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Camel toe. A camel is an animal and it has a toe. Totally innocent no title. Way. Camel it's totally toe. Totally innocent. <laughs> I, I knew Can't I should have gone with that there, one. Sherry. <laughs> and to make matters worse, my phone's still glitching so completely. The screen's totally blank as I'm drawing, so I have no clue what this even looks like until. Oh. Oh. Type in a convincing oh, no. title now. NC-17? Oh, yeah. We should have a disclaimer up for this video. Yeah. Hey! Really. And here are your choices. Right. <laughs> uh, <Hi>. Hey! <laughs> and here are your picks. And the random decoy game is true. Right? Only one of you didn't mess that one up. <laughs> Let's take a look at our next piece <laughs> of art. Uh. <laughs> Okay, here are your choices. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, nice. Right, land shark? He's in the middle of the 12 steps. <laughs> Here's everybody's picks. <laughs> that was a good one. Thank you. Nice, that was a good one. <laughs> Oh, Congrats to the one player who tell. got that one right. Good job. Good job. Okay, yes, we're playing Jackbox games tonight. They're getting progressively more. Okay, I'm sending out another round of out. titles for everybody to draw. I got 
my light keeps falling. annoying 30 second timer now you've been warned ding 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 all right i've got your pictures now it's time to share okay it's gonna be bad enter your titles now And here are your choices. I don't like it when nice. everybody gets awesome. it right, but Very I'm nice. a petty person. <laughs> Dang. Running away. Type in a convincing title now. <laughs> <laughs> Are your choices? <laughs> and here are your picks. Maybe you're all too good at this game. <laughs> Rest of us out with this um, and this one right yeah and oh, then wow. this so yeah it kicked me out and then i had like 10 seconds to draw something <laughs> Choices. Hey! Oh, can I can I change it? Here's everybody's picks. Oh no, that's too scary. I seen the killer device like last minute. <laughs> okay, one last batch of drawing titles headed to your devices now.
that I've got all your drawings, it's time for some fun. Um, put in your titles now. Did I say that right? Please correct me if I did not. Okay, here are your choices. <laughs> oh, I see what it says hey. right now. What did everybody pick? <laughs> wow, everybody got that one. I guess we're going to have to make these harder. I'm surprised you guys could see that. <laughs> Jessica Simpson one was Yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> um. Enter anything that could almost make sense now. Oh boy. Just almost though. And here are your choices. Hey! What? And okay. here are your picks. Hey! <laughs> Only one of you got that? I expected more from you. Leave it to Ray. Um. Type in your titles now. <laughs> Here are your choices. <laughs> Thing. Yeah. These answers are on point. Five. All right. Who picked what? <laughs> oh, very nice. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nobody, nobody got that one. Well, okay then. <laughs> I had no idea where to go with that one. <laughs> hey! Ah! Oh! Nope. Congratulations! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, you yeah. got that both times, <laughs> right? <laughs> Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and the volume looks like Ken saying the volumes. Drowning this out. The important part. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's a balancing act trying to get the audio right. This is like the closest right? thing without like drowning one or the other out. There you go.
guys go. All right. There's another one, a different game that they have. I, I should get the pack for it or just download the game itself, but it's hilarious. What's it like? Um, <clears throat> you have to pick sound effects to, like, I don't know how to explain it. You're, you're basically picking sound effects, and it's super inappropriate, and it's hilarious. <laughs> I'm gonna show the packs. Um, it oh, depends. Yeah. I got this on Steam for like <gasps> Falcor. Falcor. Oh. Bubbers. All right, everybody's in. All right. Oops. There we go. <laughs> Hi, I'm your host, Cookie, and this game will be broadcast Hi, Cookie. in 112 languages. You'll just be seeing the English version, though. Three players ready for action. Lock and load. Let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool, and you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. In October of 2013, eight sixth graders from a New York college <laughs> prep school were hospitalized after someone Rona. released blank in a classroom. <laughs> now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Do it now. Okay, here are your choices. Find the truth and touch it on your device. Okay, what did everyone pick? Very nice, very nice. Most likely from being instantly dogpiled by dozens of supermodels. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Yeah, I don't know what Soray is. All right, pick a category. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Okay, here's the question. Instead of having guard dogs, police in rural parts of China's Xinjiang province use blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Oh, dang. Wow. All right, who picked what? <laughs> These are mean. You all got it. Impressive. Yeah, you think it's funny, and then one day you get tased by a goose. And that's it. Nobody else's lies got picked. Soon. No, no bats. Very nice. Very nice. Time to pick a category. Oh, boy. Okay, here's the question. On December 3rd, 2009 and March 30th, 2010, rapper Eminem tweeted a photo proving he was surprisingly really good at blank. Enter your lies now.
Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. All right, let's see what everybody picked. That was good. Good job. And that means this lie didn't get picked. Good job. Now it's round two, where all point values are doubled. Let's do it. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. All Grim Acres is a nine-hole miniature golf course oddly located in an Illinois blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Ooh, brothel. Everyone else went to the morbid side except... Sorry. <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah. It's hard to get your ball out of the cup, though. Those holes are six feet deep. And look at what we have left. <laughs> One single, lonely, pitiful lie. Oh, to the top. Select a category. All right, Ray, your turn. All right, let's go with... Okay, here's the question. When soccer player Stefan Schwartz signed with Sunderland in 1999, the team made sure that his contract specifically prohibited him from traveling to blank. Enter your lies now. Where's the truth? Oh, my oh God. man. Ooh. Okay, oh, boy. Mm. Good one. This is a good one. Again, if, if it wasn't then, it is now. Okay, let's take a look. Oh. Good shot. That's a good one. <laughs> he was hoping to take a commercial flight to outer space, or as they call it in Europe, foot space. And we're done. Nice. Ooh. Technically, like lower. I think so, right? All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Budget hotel chain Travelodge reported that between 2006 and 2007, about 95% of sleepwalkers found in their hotels were blank men. Type in your lies now. That's too obvious. That's what I was going to put in there. 
Nick, you're not late at all. Oh, Hurry, God. hit the live for me oh, button God. if you can't God. think of something. Go, 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 go. <laughs> okay, what? here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> oh, man. Single naked to be married. This is a good one. Yeah. All right, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> and the rest of the board goes unselected. That'd be embarrassing to wake up to. Right. Yep. Welcome to the final finish. Mm. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. Here's your final fibbage question. Strange brand name for the cigarettes sold by the Enlightened Tobacco Company in the 1990s. Enter your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> Land shark, they're probably oh the man. They just got busted. Dang. <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. <laughs> what? Well, you guys blew it. <laughs> Just death. <laughs> and nobody <laughs> fell for this one. Dang. Rick was on the right path in the chat. Right. <laughs> Good game, guys. Good game. That was. Good job, Carrie. Good job. Good job to everybody. That was good. Let's good. try lice water. Okay. That can be like our our grand finale. We can get through that. Cause cool. It's pretty quick. So pause that. So do you guys have the side chat up right now? Mm -hmm. I can't figure it out. The side chat? Yeah, I don't know how to, where or how I would get that up. That's what she said. Oh. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, why didn't I think of this earlier? Here we go. Sorry, everybody. I, I couldn't see the side chat until just now. There we go. It's multitasking is difficult. There's actually right. like, I got four different screens going right now <laughs> to try to keep track of everything. Oh, God. Right? Yeah. Yep. And the phone. Too. No, Ken, there are no snacks today. Except for a little bit of this. Oh, what am I? Hold up, hold up. Resume share. Facts pulled from the following fact categories. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Yeah. 30% of people have lied about seeing The Godfather. Use your device oh, to pick whether you think the fact is true or a lie. Ken, no hot snacks <laughs> Three generations of beer drinking goats have been mayor of a Texas border town.
Some of these have to be stranger than fiction. Oh, wow. <laughs> yep, they are. The Atari arcade game Gotcha had controls shaped like women's breasts. Sure. Sure. <laughs> A boner actually contains a bone. I don't think anyone's allowed to get that wrong. Although I <laughs> An episode of Star Trek had Captain fastest. Kirk trapped on a planet That's what of she jazz. Said. That's what she said. Oh, you should know this. I never got into the original series. Oh. And yes, Landshark, uh, the whiskey is for cleaning the keyboard. <laughs> the Great Barrier Reef is the largest reef in the Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> Betty White once competed on American Ninja. I could see that happening in, oh. yeah, even in a parallel universe. No. I could see it as maybe a joke. Oh. And here's where everyone stands at the end of round one. Here are your next seven fact categories. Reese Witherspoon has pet donkeys named Honky and Tonky. Absolutely. <laughs> Why wouldn't she? It rained thousands of frogs in Serbia in 2005. Yes. Otters don't have nipples, Dumb. so they vomit milk into their pup's mouths. What? No way. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> During World War II, the French built a fake version of Paris to fool German planes. Spiders can survive in the vacuum of space. <laughs> ABBA owns 15% of IKEA's stock. are more likely to poop on people who wear perfume. <laughs> Here are your scores. Nice. <laughs> For the final round, all the facts will be about one category. That category is... Cereal mascots. See if you can figure out which of these facts about cereal mascots are true and which ones are lies. Snap, Crackle, and Pop were originally called Blam, Kapow, and Bonkers. Wasn't there a fourth one, though? An old wrinkled woman named Esther was the mascot for Raisin Bran from 1984 to 1989. <laughs> what? Why not, though? I mean... Wow. Ah. <laughs> it's like childhood, though. Like childhood Coco Puff's stuff. original mascot was a blowfish named Sir Puffington. Wow. 
One of the first mascots for Kellogg's Frosted Flakes was Newt the New. Why is that what flew out of the box when they opened it? Toucan Sam's best friend was a wallaby in a straitjacket named Loopy. Come on. Wow. Good. Cheerio's mascot was originally a little girl named Cheerio Leary. Oh, come on. Lucky the Leprechaun was briefly replaced with Waldo the Wizard. Is that like the off brand? <laughs> Waldo the Wizard. Good job. Good job. Very nice. Let's see the final scores. Suited to the true or false. Ken, no, I suck at true or false or anything. <laughs> 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 I'm sure. I leave it all up to you guys. What would you like to do? Sure. It's time for another game of Lie Swatter. You're going to see seven crazy facts pulled from the following fact categories. Oh, I'm on mute. I was on mute the whole time. Horse racing oh, no. is illegal in Kentucky. I'm gonna say. The ketchup yeah. squeeze bottle was developed by NASA. Wow. Oh. What? <clears throat> Every single Japanese emperor but one has died of poisoning. Wow. Yeah. Babies are covered in grape jelly to simulate birth fluids in movies. That's kind of gross. Why not, right? Looks like there's something <laughs> safer than jelly. <laughs> <laughs> what? Charles Darwin studied to become a priest. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Kafka's The Metamorphosis was originally titled The Very Bad Day. Mm. <laughs> Electric eels produce electricity by slapping their genitals into their gallbladder. <laughs> <laughs> I want well, this I to be true. <laughs> <laughs> and here's where everyone stands at the end of round one. Good job. For real. Oh, whoops. our butts on that one. Here are your next seven fact categories. Oh, Kurt Cobain and Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> Marilyn Monroe was Marky named the Mark. Artichoke Queen in 1947. The French horn was the first instrument to be played in space. Hmm. Wow. Are you 
ukulele. Kurt Cobain okay, was a voice on Shining Time Station. What is that? Does anybody know what that is? What is that? Kiss lost a rowing competition to the Brady Bunch in Battle of the Network Stars. We've got to find the video of that, if that's true. Right. <laughs> oh, dang it. <laughs> I think we can still make that happen. Mark Wahlberg dedicated his memoir, Marky Mark, to his penis. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> oh, it's just like him, isn't it? <laughs> Doubt it. There is a penguin sanctuary named after Julia Roberts in South Africa. Of course there is. Oh. Benjamin Franklin said on his deathbed that he regretted starting a public library. I did really Here are your scores. That yeah, there he goes. Still leading the way. Oh yeah. For the final round, all the facts will be about one category. That <laughs> nice category kid. is more. Check out these facts about uh, more things, and let's try to separate the truth from the lies. More people have cell phones than toilets. There are more people currently alive than all the people who have ever died. Yeah. <laughs> there are more cows than people in New Zealand. I heard that about Sacramento too. Yeah. <laughs> There are more Mondays each year than Fridays. Wow. Feels like it. <laughs> yeah, there right. are more penguins at the North Pole than the South Pole. There are more tigers in Texas than in the wilds of India. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that? Yeah. Or Oklahoma, at least. <laughs> oh. Nice. Carol fucking Baskin, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> there are more lies in this game than truths. Aw, oh, come on. See the final scores. I'm pretty sure Ray's won more nah, games nice. total than everybody, too. I think so. He, he is the champion. Out of the game. That was fun. That was, fun. That was a good time. Yeah. Oh. What is the matter? How's baby? Baby, not half a. No. <laughs> Sounds I don't know what's wrong with her. Shining Time Station is an American children's television series. I don't remember that. Does anybody remember that? No. The name is familiar, but not like the theme of it or anything like that. Like, I, it's totally not ringing a bell. What was it? Shining Time Station. Is that like a what came first? Was that first or was uh, Thomas the Tank Engine first? Was that like a knockoff of Thomas? Let's hmm. look it up. Oh, interesting. Where's the nuts? Here we go. Shining. You need a bottle or something. Hmm. 
Oh, it is 11 o'clock, I guess. Can we get it, Carrie? Can we know what it is? What's that? Oh, did you get it? I got what it. What Shining yeah, Time it's... Station is? The American show. So this would have been before Thomas the Tank, right? Okay. I think. 89 1989 yeah i oh, think so here i'll look that up it was on pb oh i know this show yes. okay okay yeah four years yeah no way in thomas the... the tank engine first appeared in 1946 wow what? right how is that even possible Right. Thomas the tank Holy engine. Holy cow. Goes my search history. Wow, yep. That started in nineteen forty five. That's kinda cool, actually. Right? <laughs> and and who, it had such a history. What was the what was the <laughs> true or false? Was it Kurt, was that the Kurt Cobain one? Kurt Cobain, yeah. Yeah, he would have been that too he old, right? it or something. Oh, if, if I guess if he was just on the show, he could have been on it. But it was false. Well, anyway, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yep. he would have been like in his mid to yeah mid twenties at that yeah. point. So he would have been way too old for the show. They got to make that one with Kiss happen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> yes. Oh. Aren't most oh, of the yes. Brady ones still alive? If not all of them. Think so. Yeah, I don't think any. I think of them maybe are... Alice is gone, but. Oh yeah, yeah. Photo Pappy. She... Yeah. H.R. Puffin stuff. I've, I've heard, heard that heard name. Of it. Yeah. H.R. Puffin stuff. I was looking up all the old school shows. Oh, this one. Oh, the parents are both gone too. Mm, From Brady Bunch. Okay. I was gonna say because that was that was quite some time ago. So I'm like I'm sure most of the kids would probably still be alive. The yeah. Forgetting the character Alice. Yeah, she would definitely have passed by now. Yeah. Oh man, HR Puff and stuff. Is that a dragon? It's um basically (laughs) (laughs) I might have to watch a little bit on YouTube. (laughs) Yeah. To to get a feeling for this. Puff and stuff. (laughs) So it wasn't just a clever name. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Did they also produce so Cheech and Chong? <laughs> right. <laughs> Executive they use some of the same Marin. footage. <laughs> right. Yep. H- HR Puff and stuff was a large mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no way. <laughs> oh my gosh. See, where are these kinds of kids shows today? This is what we I need. Know. Right. I mean, I thought it was bad enough when the Teletubbies had that giant baby sun just, you know, creepily in the Down. sky. Oh, the Teletubbies, right. yeah. God. Oh, as if they weren't creepy they enough. Were... Right. Did you see the one picture? It showed like the Teletubbies in relation to like a person, and they were like massive. <laughs> it's like I don't no. know if. I don't know if like that somebody just like made that up, but it was like if the Teletubbies weren't terrifying enough, imagine these massive. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! They're like seven yeah. feet tall, and they have like the little pointy things out right. of their head. Yeah, that would give me nightmares. <laughs> Sigmund the sea monster. What is that? Doctor Shrinker. Electra Woman and Dinah Girl. Are these all from HR Puff? Are these? <laughs> I know. Like, are are these just shows all on their own? Stuff or... 
Doctor Shrinker. <laughs> uh, we, is the HR puff and stuff still, or are we talking like other nefarious characters at this point? I can just see like Cialis and Viagra commercials on during Doctor Shrinker. Yes, right. Exactly. <laughs> Don't want Dr. Shrinker stopping by. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Saturday afternoon live action goodness. What the heck? I'll see. Electra Woman and Dinah Girl. Hey, Wit. Hey, Wit. Welcome hey. Back. Yeah, when I was a kid, it was Looney Tunes and like. Uh... What else was on Saturday morning? Muppet Babies? I can't remember any of the other shows that were on on Saturday mornings. Obviously, I watched the Muppet Babies. (laughs) (laughs) I I remember the Muppet Babies. I I would have been like... That was, yeah, right around the time I was like really getting into like cartoons and like Saturday morning stuff was right Mm -hmm. in then. And then it was like right after that they started up with Tiny Toons and Animaniacs was another one. Yes. That, Animaniacs. That was the one. Yeah. Yep. yep. There was a bunch from that time. Those were like the, not the classic classics. I mean, these aren't like the ones like you find on some of the cartoon channels now where it was like made in the 60s and horribly inappropriate, but it's right. like from our youth. Those are those were the classics. Nope. Yeah. What about um man Ren and Stimpy? Like <laughs> that was some weird <laughs> yeah like, looking I've back seen, now. I've seen some vines with Ren and Stimpy. I'm like, that was the actual show. <laughs> like it was just crazy. Right. That, yeah. Yes. Like there's one episode. A... Oh, go ahead. I was just gonna say that was very much a boys show. <laughs> There's one episode I remember, like, it scarred me. Uh, <laughs> one of them had a razor, and they were razoring their tongue, and it, like, zoomed It zoomed in to, like, the taste buds, being <laughs> like, like, oh, no. And, oh, yeah, it, that man. <laughs> it was such a weird show. <laughs> God. Oh, uh, that's like Willy Wonka. I remember that movie creeped me out as yes. a kid. Yeah. That who was it that infl- that filled up with helium and floated to the top? Oh, oh Violet. Roof of salt. Oh, that's you're talking about when they drank the the fizzy whatever and they floated up towards the fan when Charlie yeah. is his grandpa. Yeah. Yeah. That was crazy. And then the tunnel on the way to the on down the chocolate river. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It was just <laughs> insanity. They had a little HR puff and stuff before they made that movie. Yeah, for real. <laughs> they had a little Saturday morning pick me up before they started on that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fraggle Rock. Yes. Yeah, Witness. Wit. Yeah, so- we never had cable either growing up. So it was like Disney Afternoon and TGIF with the. Uh, oh, man, TGIF. Yeah, with uh, not growing pains, Full House and Family Matters. Yes. Yep. Ah, oh, the good old like days. Steve Urkel. Just the good ones. God. Yep. Yep. Try. I tried to watch Fuller House, but it then you realize how bad Full House was. <laughs> I was like, it yeah. was. It just wasn't funny for me anymore. <laughs> It wasn't. It's like there were some redeeming scenes with the sisters. Like some of the sister scenes were pretty good, but some of the rest of it was like, no, the, this show hung its hat like twenty years ago. You yeah. Know, was there was was everybody back except for uh, the Olsons? I think like so. Uncle Je- like Uncle Joe and Uncle Jesse and. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. They all, all of them came back except for the Olsen twins. That was really that was it. Yeah. Whoa. Uh, oh, the Oompa Loompas. <laughs> well, buddy. 
So on a flip side, what's the scariest movie you've stumbled into on TV? Oh, I used to wake up in the middle of the night as a kid. Just couldn't couldn't sleep and my dad would be watching Friday the 13th or uh, or Nightmare on Elm Street. And then, yeah, of course, then I couldn't go back to sleep either. <laughs> yeah. Um, what was I that movie? That... Oh, go ahead. I was going to say, I had that same exact thing. I'm trying to remember. Like, I would wake up because I'd have to sleep with the TV on sometimes. And like I would wake up. There was this one. I know there's a couple movies. And one, I don't know the name of it. But the whole part of the story that I woke up to was it was like this dance class. Like they were all doing ballet and stuff. And there was like this really high pitched frequency that people couldn't hear except for like a bunch of rats that were in the walls or something. And they were freaking out and apparently this like frequency was going to make people's heads explode and everybody knew it except the people in the room. It was super bizarre. And that was playing at like one o'clock in the morning. I was probably 10 years old, 11 years old, something like that. Like watching this, waking up to this movie. I'm like, what? What am I watching right now? Oh, it's terrible. But. Wow. I don't know, the last, last movie I didn't stumble across on tv but um we saw it at the theaters it was uh it was like an alien movie that took place up in alaska and it was like within the last i want to say five to ten years i don't know if you remember that one uh i can't remember the name of the movie but they advertised it as like you know actual footage and like all this other like stuff and i don't know something about that movie like freaked me out like uh, that night i had the lights on and it was yeah <laughs> oh it was um lilu multipass what's that actress's name mila jovovich oh, was she in that movie i don't remember um i think god what is it <sighs> i think land shark 30 days of night no no he no, um, said aliens in it yeah it was like um did they do a lot of the like where they flip the um like the night vision? No, um, no, no. Mm-hmm. Like I don't know. They advertise the whole thing as like you know this is actual footage taken from security cameras and stuff like that. Um, but then you look into it and it really wasn't. Um, hmm. Let's see, I, I'm I'm googling real alien movie. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the one that freaked me out when I was a teen was Fire in the Sky. Oh. You remember that movie? That alien that movie? That name is so familiar. The what fourth is it? kind. Yeah, okay. Oh, uh, okay. That's the one I was thinking of. I don't know why I thought Mila Jovovich was in it. Yeah. Yep, the fourth kind. Yep. Because, yeah, they supposedly had, like, uh, dash cam footage from the police cruisers and all this stuff. And, I don't know, after that movie, I was like, I was like nope because <laughs> like there were i don't know there were like owls in the movie that had something to do with like the aliens and at the time where we were living there would be like owls outside and like you'd always hear them and it's like nope <laughs> yeah I re- now i can remember the trailers for that yeah yeah no. yep signs i love that movie mm-hmm. oh my God. doma poi asked if we remember huckleberry hound and quick draw mcgraw huckleberry oh I remember the, I names. the names. Huckleberry yeah. Hound, yeah. Is that Hanna Barbera? Yes. Was it? Yeah. I think so. Quick Drum McGraw. Quick Drum McGraw. <laughs> Moto Pappy. Yeah, Scary movies don't really impact me. <laughs> I worked for Chuck E. Cheese through college. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, Hanna Barbera. Quick draw McGraw. God, the name is familiar. I don't don't know that I ever saw like any of the cartoons or anything like that. If that's, I just, I know like what it's referencing. Yeah, I can picture Huckleberry Hound. Mm -hmm. I always think of uh, Tombstone though when I hear Huckleberry. Yes. Yep. You guys remember Space Jam? Space Jam. I was a huge Michael Jordan fan and all throughout like 
middle school and, and high school. So yeah. My kid's been watching it on Netflix. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. It's fun. It's a fun movie. Yep. 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 Has he got it on repeat? Yeah. <laughs> oh honey. That's the movie of the movie of the week now. Space Jam. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So once supposedly they're, they're making they're making a LeBron James is making a second one, but no way. <laughs> is it really? I'd heard about it for the longest time, but maybe with it's a, today's maybe it's, a, maybe it's an internet myth. With today's like technology and stuff, that could look really cool. Because back in the day, like Space Jam was like, oh, this is awesome. Yeah. yeah. All right, real quick, I'm gonna throw some uh, Mandela effect at you. Um, I know this has been talked about online and everything, but Shazam with um. Fuck. What, it wasn't Shaq because I think that was Kazam. Oh, that's right. Oh, you're talking about the Shazam. new one with, with uh, no. Zachary Levi or no? Yeah, right. But no, like Not back. It was like it was around the time when Shaq had his thing going on, but it was called Shazam, and it was with um. Oh God, who was that comedian from back in the day? Um, uh, he always wore the flashy stuff. Sinbad. Sinbad, yeah. And if you if you look it up, because we were actually talking about it at work, and some other people at work were like, "Yeah, I remember it was Sinbad, and he wore like this genie outfit and everything." Now it's starting to um, ring a bell, yeah. Right, but it doesn't exist. And if you start to look into it more, it's part of the Mandela effect. Like hundreds of thousands of people remember that movie, remember <laughs> going to the store and renting it, but it never existed. What? <laughs> like, yeah, it was like the weirdest thing it like it had been erased from history it's i don't know like if you're remembering it like yeah because i i i don't know it's so weird it's like i remember there being the shack version and then the other version with sinbad which you know was different but i, I don't know huh <laughs> yeah yep little little mandela effect that's crazy Any, yeah Anybody in the side chat uh, remember that <laughs> or think they remember it? That's making me rack my brain because I worked at Blockbuster for a few years, like when I was way younger. And I remember that being a point of discussion back then. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah Land Shark. Land Shark. Yeah. That's probably what it was. Like, all, yeah, the like weird outfits and stuff you'd wear, but I don't know. <laughs> how do you mix up Shaq and Sinbad <laughs> well no like I don't know like Shaq had his own thing but it's like you, I don't know. it's like Hammer you pants. swear yeah. you, you remembered it was like a different movie yeah that's crazy that is yep. that's like yep. uh, well it's not like that but I remember a few years ago when they were doing that like they were gonna make a Crocodile Dundee sequel, and that was just an ad campaign for Australia, I think. Right. Yep. I was and like, I was like looking, cool. waiting for the movie to come out, and I'm like, wait, whatever happened to that movie? And it turns out it was just an ad campaign. <laughs> right. Exactly. Well, yep. it worked. Yeah. Right. <laughs> there was I thought it would have been a cool next movie. Best thing. Yeah. Yep. yep. Let's go down to. All Australia. right, guys. I gotta go. Bye. I gotta okay. go. Little little miss is not having it. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. Let's go I'll ahead and wrap s- it up, actually. So go ahead and hop off, Ray. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys later. <laughs> All right. All right. Bye. How do I get out of here, though? <laughs> do I just... Just close Zoom. Oh, leave meeting. Yeah, leave Maybe meeting. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 <laughs> Yeah, I didn't realize how late it got. I was, we were playing the games for probably a good solid hour or so, I think. So yeah, yeah. But this it didn't seem awesome. like that. Yeah, yeah, it was fun. Yeah, it flew by pretty quick. So thank you guys in the chat for coming and hanging out. And there will be no spicy food for the future. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we can't do that to Ray's laptop ever again, even though he did. Technically, spill more on it today. So <laughs> it was before the stream started.
So thank you for joining us on the stream today. I appreciate you coming and hanging out and playing games with us. It was fun. But yeah, yeah we'll go ahead. Oh, now it's frozen. Nope. There you are. Yeah, it was sticking. <laughs> Spicy food is rented. It's rented. We're, it's rented because it's renting a space of peace and it's being, you know what? I'm getting too philosophical. Spicy food sucks. Okay. It hurts. <laughs> and we got more jalapenos last week and it, it made my, it just, it hurt. It physically pains. And we have more in the fridge. So there's more on the way. All right, guys. Right. And gals. Yep. Thank you guys in the chat. Thank you, that one guy, for hanging out with us tonight. Appreciate it. Yeah, it was fun. Catch you guys on the next one. Have a good rest of the night. Yeah. Stay healthy. Take care, everybody. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. That's right. Six feet yeah. apart. Yes. Be smart. Yep. What did you say, babe? He said, okay. He said something about touching butts. We're going to log off on that <laughs> note, So. <laughs> well, yeah, All we right, need Sir Flesh Wound to peek guys. through the, the background. Yeah. Needs, His beard just needs, needs to, to poke like, through. Yeah. Right there. Right, right on Joe Exotic's face. Right there. Hey, babe, come here. Because I want you to replace Joe Exotic's face. Then you can show off that magnificent beard of you. Here he comes. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Nice. That that's the way to end it right there. There we go. Yep. All right. Ending it's it on the high note. Have a good night, guys. Bye everybody. Bye.